Hey everyone, I'm Neil, this is Dan. And we wanted to talk a little bit more about lateral movement, how threats move laterally east-west in environments. It comes up all the time in customer conversations. So we wanted to know, you know, what does that amount to? The easiest way to think about east-west movement is really like a lightning strike. Uh, when it strikes, it's going to try and spread and spider as far as it can go. It's going to look for other conductive materials. It's going to keep going from there, right? That's really the same thing as east-west movement. Simple enough. Now, we've seen a lot of high-profile attacks have east-west movement, lateral movement built in. What does that really amount to? What does that really look like in the, in the, in the sense of a breach? Yeah, so uh, a lot of common threats, you know, ransomware is one of those really mm. popular ones. It's really prolific. And essentially what it does is it exploits uh, an endpoint, a workload, a server, whatever it may be, based on a specific vulnerability. Mm. And when that vulnerability is exploited, it, you know, infects the machine, and then it tries to do the same thing to other endpoints, workstations within its reach. So it's gonna keep doing that and spidering around and have that kind of pandemic effect so you start getting this massive spread of a breach. Got it, got it. Now we think about containing breaches. What's What are our best bets there? Yeah, um, first and foremost is segmentation, right? We all know breaches and eventuality. So being able to properly segment your environment so that the breaches aren't allowed to spread mm -hmm. is very important. And the other is really patch management and vulnerability management, right? These malware uh, actors, these malicious actors, these pieces of code, they're trying to exploit vulnerabilities. If we close those pathways, they won't get it. Makes sense, thank you, Neil. So many thanks for that. Uh, for if you're interested in more information, check out our other videos. Bye.